Alright, so I scanned the vehicle and got a P018B code, which points to a problem with the low fuel pressure sensor. Let's test it to see if it's actually bad. First thing I did was pull up a wiring diagram and connector layout on all data so I could figure out how the sensor is wired and what each pin does. Next, I disconnected the fuel pressure sensor connector and turned the key to on, engine off. Then, I grabbed the multimeter and set it to DC volts and tested the 5 volt reference wire and that's exactly what I got. Then, I checked the ground wire and we're seeing 12 volts coming in, which is perfect. So now we know power and ground going into the sensor are both good. So I plugged the sensor back in and back probed the pin to the signal wire. I then put the black lead on battery ground and the red lead on the signal wire pin. We're reading 4.8 volts on the signal wire. So now let's turn the engine on and see what happens. Nothing, still 4.8 volts. A good sensor shows voltage fluctuations as the fuel pressure changes, especially when the engine's running. This one, dead flat. That tells me the sensor's bad and needs to be replaced. Now after replacing the sensor, here's what the signal wire voltage should look like with the key on, engine off. And this is what it's supposed to look like with the vehicle at idle. Now if you want to learn how to replace the sensor the right way, click this video next.